Hey guys, it's Blue here, and basically the video you're about to see is a failed video that I just didn't complete, basically. I did the first day, and then I realized that the 6S is, um, the battery's really bad, and it caused it to overheat, which caused it to drain the battery even more. So, yeah, um, hope you enjoy, I guess. Hey guys, it's here, and welcome to the second channel, where today um, is basically kind of like a little behind the scenes. Actually, this, this is going to start the behind the scenes and i'll have this as a whole like behind the scenes kind of thing um basically i'm trying to set up the apple watch series zero to the iphone 6s so i can do the living in 2015 for a week video and i want these to be paired so i can pretty much just like turn my iphone 14 off and the apple watch series 6 and just like sit them on a table and not touch them for a week um and if you hear a really loud fan it is because my ac decided to die basically so until it gets fixed, this is my AC. I just have, it's it's cooler outside than it is inside. So I just got a box fan, put it to where the outside air blows in and it's actually working great. So I'm just, um, I'm just setting this Apple Watch up right now. putting in my password and yeah um it's just setting up right now um it took forever to unpair from my main phone so um i'm gonna go ahead and do the unpairing tonight for the um series two so i can go ahead and connect it to the iphone 7 i mean iphone x iphone 10 or you want to call it so um yeah um it's just gonna be like part of the behind the scenes just thinking now so um i guess i'll see you whenever all this stuff is done and i'll go ahead and get the iphone 10 and the series 2 going so see you when everything's done all right guys so everything is done um, i'm just gonna put the Apple watch series zero back over here for, or the series 2 back over here for now because i'm not going to be needing it and yeah, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow, I guess, if I have any behind-the-scenes things to show, which I probably will. Um, right now, I'm just charging the 6S, and I have the iPhone 10 is just going to sit in a drawer until um, I have the time to film a iPhone 10 for a week video. Um, I should have done it last week, but I just didn't really feel like it, basically, and I forgot about it, honestly. And the Series 2 will just sit there. The series, now, this challenge is going to be interesting because the iPhone, like, I, none of these devices have great batteries. Um, the device that has the best battery is the Apple Watch Series 0. Its battery actually lasts longer than my Apple Watch Series 6. But um, the iPhone 6S, the maximum capacity is on 78, I believe. And it's not that good. It dies pretty quick. Um, the iPhone 10, the maximum capacity is only 72. It does last longer than the 6S, I think, but not by much. Um, this Apple Watch Series 2 is really bad. The battery life's very bad. Um, it, it, just sitting here, it dies in like 18 hours. So actually being used, it, it probably dies in like four. But we'll see how it works if I ever get to it. But tomorrow... You're going to see me use an iPhone 6S and an Apple Watch Series 0 for a week. And the video is going to be titled, um, Living in 2015 for a Week. So, yeah, let's, I, actually, I have a better idea. What if I use an Xbox One for a week, too? I don't really want to do it, but I kind of do. Um, I'm going to go dig out my Xbox One out of the closet, and I'm going to use everything from 2015 for a week. Except my TV is not from 2015. But, I mean... It'll work, I guess. So, yeah, I'll see you in probably like 30 minutes. Hey, guys, it's Will here, and today I'm going to be using an iPhone 6S and an Apple Watch Series 0 for a week. So, my main phone is an iPhone 14, and my main Apple Watch is a Series 6 44mm stainless steel. And basically, I'm going to be using this 128GB iPhone 6S and this 42mm Apple Watch Series 0 for a week and just see how it goes and i was originally gonna live in 2015 like fully like i i got my xbox one out i was gonna 
use it, even though it's not really that outdated, but it d decided to not work basically. So I'm just gonna say that I didn't upgrade to the Xbox One yet, and I still have a 360 right now, because it's 2015, the Xbox One has only been out for two years at this point, so yeah, I'll just use the 360 for a week, I guess, so. Yeah, see. So this phone has pretty bad battery life, and usually it doesn't do this, but today when I turned it on, I turned it on probably like 20 minutes ago, and it went from like 80 something to 26, or to 28, and I don't know why, um, it got kind of hot, so maybe it was just like doing some stuff it needed to do when it first turned on or something. I don't know, but yeah, I'm just using this phone for a week and I am recording with my main phone, but that's the only thing I'm going to do with my iPhone 14. I'm not going to do anything else with it. So yeah, I'll see you in like probably 30 minutes or so. So I've just been playing 360. Um, right now I'm just playing through the GTA five story again, cause I'm bored. So I'll see you whenever I see you. So it is currently 105, and this phone is doing decent. Um, the battery is really bad. I could watch it go down earlier. So it's charging right now. Right now it's at 74. Um, the Series 0 is doing great, though. It's still at 91, and I haven't charged it since, like, 9 this morning. So, yeah, um, I'll see you if anything special happens. So it's 2.30 now, and um, the battery is currently at 80%. And I'm pretty sure this thing is, like, Basically, since the battery's bad, it's causing the phone to get hot, which just causes the battery to drain faster. Um, and the Apple Watch is still at 86. So the Apple Watch is doing great. I might be able to get two days out of the Apple Watch, but I'm not going to be able to get more than like two hours out of this phone. So, yeah, I'll see you whenever I see you. Hey, got some here, and it is currently 7.35 p.m., and the watch is still at 61. So I'm gonna try to get two days out of this and just see what happens. Um, the phone, I honestly don't know if I'm gonna be able to like continue this challenge or if I do, I'm basically just gonna be, um, it's just gonna turn into a not not having a phone for a week challenge because this phone's battery is getting really bad. Um, shout out to Tony from Nothing But Car Reviews. But anyways, um, basically this phone has been constantly dying. It, it's been staying consistently like warmer than it should. Um, part of it is because the room it's in, and if you see, or if if you hear like a really loud fan, it's because my um, air conditioning doesn't work right now. Um, it'll be fixed soon, but right now I don't have air conditioning upstairs, so I have a fan that is pretty much blowing cold air from outside which isn't even that cold it's 73 degrees outside but um it's a lot colder than it is in here it's 81 in here um and it's just keeping it cool in here basically so yeah um i'll see you i'm just gonna go ahead and end today so i'll see you tomorrow which will be uh the 7th